Hello, my name is Cody Wiles, and I'm a hip and knee surgeon at the Mayo Clinic in Rochester, Minnesota. And it's my honor to present our article entitled Creation of a Total Hip Arthroplasty Patient-Specific Dislocation Risk Calculator. We know that dislocation is the most common reason for a vision total hip arthroplasty, and there are multiple risk factors for this complication, such as demographics and specific comorbidities, such as spine disease and spine surgery, particularly those involving fusion, as well as neurologic disease. There are also strategies within a surgeon's armamentarium that can influence the risk of dislocation, namely the surgical approach, the acetabular liner type, and the femoral head size. We aim to combine these factors to create a multimodal dislocation risk calculator that would be built on robust patient characterization, be patient-specific, and ultimately responsive to surgical decisions. To do this, we use the Mayo Clinic Total Joint Registry to evaluate nearly 30,000 hips performed over a contemporary 20-year period. 1,500 of those patients sustained a dislocation, which was almost 3% of the primary cohort and roughly 12% of the revision cohort. From the resulting data, there are three important and actionable takeaways I would like to discuss for hip surgeons. Number one, we found that patient-specific risk of dislocation is incredibly wide ranging based on a patient's comorbid profile. The five-year risk of dislocation ranged all the way from 0.4% up to 19% for a primary hip and from 3% all the way to 42% for a revision hip. Secondly, despite that grim statistic, we also found that surgeons have immense power to modify risk as the combination of surgical approach, acetabular liner type, and femoral head size were found to be the most influential factors in the multivariable model. Furthermore, performance of an acetabular revision in a revision case further decreased the risk by approximately 40%. Number three, we produced a series of nomograms in this study that are being turned into an electronic calculator whereby surgeons can preoperatively determine a patient's risk of dislocation and see how that risk is modified by decisions within their control. We believe this will be a powerful tool to make judicious use of protective technologies and also to optimize patients for the most common complication of hip replacement surgery. For our next iteration, we are working to further improve the calculator by using deep learning to evaluate preoperative radiographs and to incorporate the impact of acetabular and femoral implant position. Stay tuned for that moving forward and thank you for taking the time to learn a little bit more about our study today.